back to this video my name is Sherry today I'll be talking about anger how do you control your anger as a Christian well you know the unbelievers are really watching our attitude if you have a misunderstanding with a non-believer they will expect you to let go of it because you have to behave like Jesus you have to respond to them in a godly manner and if you respond to them like are you crazy you know what they're gonna say they're gonna tell you that you are a believer and this is not the attitude of Christ like is it a sin for a Christian to get angry let's see what the Bible says about mm -hmm. anger it's not a sin to get angry because you are human and if someone can get you upset it is natural because you cannot go through life without being hurt by someone it is natural to be hurt by someone yeah it's, it is natural for someone to make to get you angry or to even or offend you yet it is natural but your reaction to that anger is what the time is if you have sinned against God or if you have not what does the Bible say about anger Ephesians chapter 4 verse verse 26 says be you angry and sin not let not the Sun go down upon your rocks yes the Bible says be angry as a human it is natural to be angry yes you can say something that provoke you yes it's natural but the Bible ordered or not to sin you can get angry but sin not your reaction must not be ungodly because someone can get you upset but never 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 let your anger remain in your heart till sun sets that is what the word of god says here and it is very important to rather apply this in our daily life so that we can do other things that are in line with the word of god yes be hungry but do not sin do not try to arm or do an evil do, do not try to do any evil to that person that gets you angry. If you if you if you cannot talk to that person, let it go. But don't let the rot or the hunger remain in your heart to the next day. That is when if it remains in your heart to the next day, if the rot remains in your heart to the next day, that means you are sin. And that is what God doesn't want you to do. Yes, always control your anger is normal because the child of God has to control his anger and you have to have a Forgiven spirit is very important for you to have a forgiven spirit because if you're a Christian, if you're a child of God, and you have, if you don't have a forgiven spirit in your heart, it is very dangerous because if you do not forgive others, remember what the Lord says, your sins will not be forgiven as well. And I'm sure you don't want your sins to remain before God because if your sins remain before God, that is no, that is that is dangerous because it's like if your sins remain before God and if God doesn't pardon your sins because you do not forgive others. How do you want to enter into the kingdom of God? I pray that the Lord Almighty will give us a spirit of endurance. Yes, we need that spirit so much as a Christian. The spirit of endurance, the forgiven spirit. I pray that the Lord Almighty will give it unto you as you're listening right now in the name of Jesus Christ. Anyway, thank you for so much for watching. And sure to subscribe to this channel. And you can also share this video with your loved ones and uh, share it. That's the way you can help me spread the word. Thank you for watching and God bless you all. Bye-bye.